Hello, everyone. Welcome to Iconoclasts. I just bought this a few minutes ago. Already got bored with Absolver, and uh, really wanted to give this a try from what I've seen. Mm, so exciting. Probably gonna have to adjust the volume on this. Yeah, if it's gonna be that loud, I definitely need to turn that down. Okay. that means, so screw it. We've already got normal and hard mode. And the reason I wanted to play this is because when I first saw this, this this looked like the kind of game that I wanted to design, only way more polished and with better story and more interesting characters. But the mechanics of it seemed like what I wanted from a platformer. And god damn, it just looks so good. And I heard, like, this game was made by one guy working on it for, like, six fucking years. Which is certainly an, ex an inspiring story. And thank you for that little glitter to point out that that giant triangle was different from the mountains. Ah, Dan was right. This is an old la This is a young lady in a shoe. All the, uh, don't know what that does. All the, uh, controls are what I expect them to be. A for jump, X for shoot. Awesome, that's exactly what I want. The only thing I would add to this is if you could, like, hang from platforms like this, sort of, uh, Gunstar Heroes style. That's probably about the one thing I would change. Oh. Got baby hops and full hops. Yay. Okay. So you have to push down to go through doors. I'm not sure what... I guess that's switching my weapons. Okay. Oh! can't shoot for a while after a charge shot, okay. Jump and shoot. It's jump and shoot, girl. Not a, not a huge fan of, uh, yeah, sure, I haven't done anything, why not? Whoa! I was not holding down, was I? Okay, I can use the D-pad or the control stick. Yay. I've left the house and saved my progress. Can she do that automatically? Yes, she does. I personally would prefer a grab button, but hey, if you're pressed up against a ledge, you probably want to get on. Oh, it locks on automatically. Well, that's handy. Way to show up those Mega Man games. Fall damage? No. Already fantastic. What's with these little square pixie things? I love how even the friggin' leaves are squares. And I've seen enough of this game before to know what this does. Oh wait, that doesn't work yet. Okay. Improvium, yeah, you're, you're not hurting yourself with these, trying to come up with these names, are you? And I've seen that you can jump on this guy. Can you do the stomp? I saw them doing a stomp. Yeah, I watched a few videos of this. Okay, so these ones you can blow up. 
to watch a few videos of this, otherwise Helen's what I've known about it. Oh. Yeah, and I saw that in the preview video. Okay. <clears throat> Metallium. Awesome. Can we, uh, skip out of the, uh, item titles a little faster? And... A nice tutorial boss fight. God, this character emotes so well. Doesn't seem to be locking onto the boss quite as well. Whoa! Thanks for the warning. She has to be within a certain range. And she has to be within a certain range before she can lock on. Jumps have a bit more hover to them than I rightly deserved. <laughs> I really should have... I didn't even get hit, but then... This is just the tutorial boss. Some of those jumps I was expecting to... Fuck up and get hit at least once. The fact that this gun locks on... Makes it a lot more forgiving. Have I even been hit yet? Ducking. Yes, I can. I can keep crawling as much as I want to. Nice. But you walk faster. Good. I approve of these mechanics. Is there something here? Ladders. Oh. Nice. And I can't get through this yet. Stand on the ladder. Awesome. Oh, we've got fake walls. All right. <laughs> I love that. It's so much more entertaining than a simple yes or no. One concern. Oh, come on. I can't stand on the truck. Oh, my house looks so cool from outside. Nothing at all like a shoe. Oh, yay. <laughs> She's here. Black and white. Black and white, right and wrong. Such rigid concepts. I meant that as a metaphor, as a... I meant that as a uh, ideological metaphor, not a uh, race thing. Robin, 17. Oh, 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 she's jailbait. Oh, sole house resident, no assigned occupation. Mechanic for the concern. <laughs> Time to get a job, right? Picking up his wrench. I didn't say anything. Well, I can tell these two get along famously.
unfortunate accident. Oh, lovely. You really care about your employees, don't you? Well, that's one way to make a living. Penance? How fucking irritated he gets every time he does anything. Private practice is a sin. Oh, lovely. See, so, see, so you're you're giving me a hard time because I'm helping. I'm fixing my neighbor's plumbing and shit. Really? The Almighty. Oh God. Ivory fuel. not even allowed to choose your profession. Oh, great. So you've been snooping through my things. been spotted well yeah that's not suggestive at all he's been spotted who are you who might that be oh okay ah. yeah I already figured that out yay my alternate weapon. Okay, no. Okay, that's my B button. Okay, uh... I can't go down there. That's just some aesthetic shit. And they're gone. Interesting as that conversation was, I don't think I want to repeat it. Uh, what? I can't, I can't swing. Okay, that... Wait, what? How do I do that? Oh, okay. So you can just push the jump button to go straight up, or you can hold left and right to swing in that direction. Alright. Interesting. More improvium. Let's check the menu here. Oh my god. Oh god. Thank god. Map. And I get to see all the little exit points that I can't reach. Where can we go now? I love that little subtle advice. Go explore shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's illegal to own one without being a registered mechanic. Tracks enemies within your facing. Okay. Hey, wait, I didn't want to completely leave the menu. Okay. Judging from the map, it looks like I can go down from here. Oh, okay. Now I understand the menu options. 
Oh, no, not just playing, just the menu, shit. And I can't get up there. Oh, I see, there's an area down there. So it's on the same screen, but you can't actually... I can see... Being able to catch these things. Okay, wow, you, uh... Okay. I kind of felt like my jump was kind of forcing me over in that direction and not letting me turn around for a second. Mechanics! So I'm basically locked in my own house, huh? Oh! I can use A or right trigger. Okay. Use the wrench and then press down. Is this just environment? What? Oh! Okay, you hold down and jump while you're in the air. It's not just down, it's both of them. Wrong button. Okay. I thought I'd be killing things with my wrench. No, you can't jump through that. Can I attack enemies with I can! Yes! Okay, so the spin deflects monsters. I love how it demonstrates the difference between tapping and holding. Thank you. Okay, now we get it. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock. I'm All the way done. That's not phallic or suggestive at all. Ah! Bitch! What's with these little square things drifting about through the air? Spongy. Oh. <laughs> okay, can't do it anymore. Doesn't appear to be like a double tap dash or nothing. Okay. 
Yay. Is, is this not a thing? I'm guessing I get different guns throughout the game. Been switching between Bloodborne and Absolver lately, so my muscle memory is very confused by yet a new game. Bugger, aren't you? Wouldn't think an amorphous ball of slime would be that fucking fast. Uh... Oh, you tricked me. What the hell was the point of me coming down here just to just to see that I couldn't get up that way, or what? How the hell do you style your, your ponytail in the shape of a magnet? That's realistic, slow-ass ladder climbing. Oh, and then I have to drop down and go out this way. Okay. One's an in-path, and the other's an out-path. And... Wow, I can actually squeeze through there. You need to turn down these sound effects, too. You even have that extra flair of doing the flips off of... Jesus, that's... Whoa! Yay, I finally got a health up. Where's my key? Can I, like, bounce off of you? No. I can... God, this looks so much like the keys from Mario Brothers 2. Okay. You're gonna stay there. Oh, cool. She automatically ducks when you need to crouch through an area instead of the tedium of making you do it yourself. take the item out of the treasure chest. Yeah, I gotta remember to check for fake walls after that one room. It was an interesting little area to teach me shit. And now I gotta go find the key. Damn, that is loud. Disengaging from that last one. Please jump. Oh my god, I automatically bounced off of him. Can I kill you with the door? Uh, I think that's a level of precision timing that I don't yet have. 
fake walls. I like that she actually stops when you hit a wall instead of, like, staying in her walking animation up against the wall. Like, it turns green when it's actually gonna stay open. Yay. How long have I been going for? Yay. Well, I think that's enough for now. I'd like to keep this short. Maybe do more later. I definitely don't want my videos of this to be as long as they were when I was playing The Witness. That's unnecessary. So I will see you next time.